emergency landing procedure. I know you waited for this, and you know I've waited for this one. Forever Skies is finally releasing, and we're just days away. The 22nd of June is the day you will be able to try this out for yourself for the first time since the demo. I've been incredibly lucky to have Far From Home wanting to sponsor this first episode of a potential series, and also given me access to the game a little bit earlier. And recording this, I'm actually fresh out of recording this episode that you're about to watch. And I think you can hear it that <laughs> on my excitement that it was a good one. But before we start, I want to tell you some information that I know that you want to hear. This is the start of the team's early access journey. And at this point, they are focused on delivering rock-solid survival mechanics, airship building and gameplay. The exploring is a big part of the game's final design, but right now, it's still being worked on. With diversity and one-off unique locations being added throughout the development to run in tandem with various updates and how the story mode will progress. Whew. And this one is going to be a big one for you guys. The team will 100% be adding four-player co-op as a major update. Hopefully this year. And you heard me mention the story mode, right? And this will be added throughout the early access and more till the final chapter will be added at the end of the early access. Just like you've seen before with Green Hell, Raft, Subnautica, all of those had stories added later to the game. A fizz, what will the story be about? <laughs> well, the story will be about coming back to a ecologically ruined Earth to hunt down viral pathogens dude there's so many words that's so hard for my swedish little brain <laughs> research them to create medicine to help save what remains of humanity living in orbit last but not least console players you will be pleased to hear that you will be able to play this game at the end of the early access this applies to next gen only though thank you for sitting that through Let's get in and experience the early access for Forever Skies for the first time. My name is Fisk. Enjoy the video. Look at that view. Smooth landing, if you ask me. I think we're all fine. <laughs> all right, we are back. And let me tell you, dude, I'm so excited for this. If you're new to the channel and don't know, I found this game back in uh, when it was just a demo. And I made a couple of video about videos about it. And it's ever since then, it's been really close to my heart. And I'm just so happy to be able to be here to play the early access of Forever Skies. Uh, okay, I won't hold you any longer. Let's, uh, let's just jump into this. Let's read uh, the notes. Sagittarius 2 went silent for months. Then, this one signal. And then silent again. None of us know what awaits you down there. But if there's a chance that they have found the virus, and maybe we can survive. Find the virus sample at all costs. The faith of us all depends on you. Alright, the first little touch of lore for you guys. Let's uh, get this one, and let's get out of here. We arrived at the source of the signal. So this first uh, part right here, obviously we've seen, but for you guys that are new to the channel or seen this game for the first time, I will make sure to play through everything. So let's just grab some scrap right here. Yeah, we need to get our hands on that, uh, well, on some food first of all, don't we? Some drinks. We have the PC. We need the solid state battery. All right, look at this. I'm so excited. So pretty much what's happened here is uh, the world got hit by a uh, massive climate disaster that, uh, you say, rendered the uh, the Earth uninhabitable. So obviously you can see on the skyscrapers and stuff like that, that this is Earth. And we have a little bit of a, of a dust going on. A dust? Some dust, maybe. Oh, everything's been screwed up since we found that damn virus. 
we're all getting sick equipment is breaking down and then there is this noah situation the power blew out again and the door is locked so i'll uh, i'll check if the beacon tower has a com compatible battery so yeah this is earth and we're back to it to find a virus to uh find or to be able to make a cure right let's get up here we go we got the melons I think I've learned not to consume them, but I kind of do want to consume them. <laughs> we might want to wait a little bit. Let's check this guy. No, we can't scan anything yet, can we? Open this. And we have the solid state. Let's take the quick way down. Slap it in. Let's listen to this message. We were down under the dust. We found the lab where they first analyzed the virus 400 years ago. That's when it all started to go to hell. Noah went crazy. The bastards stole the sample, our airship, and broke the radio, leaving us here to die. He's dangerous as hell. The location of the sample is at the overgrown glass house. A scientist lived there who studied flora from under the dust. If you want to get there, try visiting some radio towers and wind farms to get necessary devices. Be careful, though. This world no longer wants us. It is not a place for humans anymore. All right, let's get in here. Let's push further. We have the electricity. Yoink, get all of that. We have this boy. We got some food, some drinks. We should get that in as I feel. There we go, all good. And let's read this. It's all because of this damn dust. Noah heard voices. He was mumbling about nature surviving everything. Even the fall of the world. He said he knew what to do so we could return to Earth again. He wanted us to help him. To follow the voices in his head. What a lunatic. We locked him in a cell for his own good. But the bastard hid the extractor and ran off while everyone was asleep. The thing is, they make him sound uh, kind of crazy right but maybe he is right here you know maybe he is uh, connected with the, some Power kind of spores spores down there oh we should be good ah there we go there she is our old butte oh it seems like we have a water purifier and a uh, alert container that is so dope i like that so uh, it's a little bit different from the last time Let's get the empty bottle. Fill up. This might actually have something with the difficulty to do as well. I know I started on uh, normal. So that, that might be it. I actually don't know. Let's see if we can uh, get this. We're going to put this in the ship. We're going to put it right here. I feel like I optimized the way of building on this. I might be wrong though, but I kind of like this one. So with this, we can extract raw resources. Oh, there we go. Unlocked a lot of blueprints here. All right, let's uh, read this note. I've been building a new airship for two months. Since that bastard Noah got away with our equipment, if only my workshop hadn't collapsed, I would have already had the airship engine researched and completed. Place the rather fabricated deck extractor. So pretty much that's a list of what we need to do right now. I can swear this looks different. Some food, a condenser membrane. Immunity I think. Is decreasing. Diseases might become more severe. All right, calm down. Uh, let's see here. We actually need to put this in, right? Add the membrane. There you go. So now this one is gonna drag all the moisture out of the air and just push it down in here, right? It's so good to actually have a little bit of knowledge how to get all of this started already. If you guys want to know how I reacted to the first time I actually saw this place, go back and check the old videos. They were a hoot. Let's uh, grab some meds. Getting a healthy amount of loot. We need to get up and we need to get more water, right? We're going to be uh, collecting all of that. We need to get ourselves some, uh, some more bottles, though. I want to believe I was able to scan in the beginning. I don't have the scanner right now. Oh, there's a lot of water. All right, fair enough. Let's get that to deck extractor, shall we? Let's crawl this. 
And obviously, some of you guys... Uh, I think with the most of it, most of us actually saw the uh, the resemblance to other survival games that we played on this channel, like Rafts of Nautic and Green Hell. It's uh, the devs called this game a love letter, le letter to those games, and I I think uh, they've uh, they done a great job on this. Let me tell you, uh, I want to place this right here. Let's do some extraction. So with this, we're going to be collecting some metals and some um, synthetics. This we will use to upgrade our ship. A really solid way to actually collect stuff so you don't have to run around all too much. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can also do this with walls and such to get metals. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We need to do that door. It even says in the left corner, but you guys know how I work with reading. It takes me a while to get there. There you go. It's open. Is this it? Yoink. This looks... Wait, 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 wait. What's this? Place on your airship. This is something new. I haven't seen this one before. Last time I was in there, I think we found the engine, did we? Oh. Intrigued. What does this do then? Wait, how do... Oh, okay, okay. The battery. Can we even get that? Wait, where do we get the battery? Do we have another battery in here? Oh, there it is. Yoink. Two of them, even. We got a note. I managed to repair the research station. There are a few old blueprints preserved on the memory card, but the most important one is scanner. It is necessary to complete his research and crafting. After that, it should scan certain objects in the world so we can acquire more data for blueprints to research. I need a battery to run the device. I dug out this old power box from the ruins. The supplies should be inside. Bloop. Oh, that's cool. Use this to research. Okay, this is all new. This is so cool. Uh, we got a repair patch. Repairs damaged objects and devices one time use. All right, so that's good to know. We have the empty bottle. We need more bottles and we need the scanner. This one you're going to attach to your arm. Oh. As you can see, this game, like the animations and everything, it's really solid, isn't it? This is because we have a, a very experienced team behind this. Some of them have worked on Dying Light, Dying Light 2, Dead Island, The Medium, Chernobyl Light, League of Legends, and Divinity Original Sin. You should have at least one title in there that you know. Now we can craft the scanner. Let's see if we can uh, research everything that we have. Put this on while we're waiting. Detected new objects requiring research finalized. Oh, a lot of things happening right now. So now we can go around and scan everything like this. Glass components. Dirty water. Synthetics. Engine fuel. Look at that. Scuffling. That's what you call it, right? Scuffling, yes. Oh, I actually need to show you guys something. Some of you actually know what I'm about to do. Some of you don't, but look at this. Here she goes. How cool is that? I like it. They could have just chosen to not have the building do that. You know, dude, I'm getting hungry, aren't I? Do I even have anything? Oh, yeah. There you go. We're good. We have some water. Let's actually see if we can get a water purifier as well. A small storage box. We need that. We need plastic scrap for that. And then we need the engine as well. Oh, so you can do that. Okay, so you can actually put the progress that you have down. That's actually nice. Let's do the water bottle then. And then I want to move this one over here again. I want to put it right there. And I want to get the glass. Just so we have it. And now let's get the engine and fuel. We need that. Right here, the purifier. We need synthetics. That's the only thing that we need. So let's get that going. 
see if we have enough. We do. I think we're going to get two of those. Let's research a little bit more. Dude, I'm I'm like a mad scientist over here. Going nuts. Thank you. Let's get this one. <laughs> Let's get this one. Oh, synthetics. Something I would recommend right here in the beginning. Spend time to get everything that you can to make your life easier on on the on your ship pretty much put up some water purifiers just to figure out the uh, water situation this is going to go nuts on that one and we have a lot of water that we want to purify up there as well uh so that's why i'm saying we should actually make two of this let's make some fuel i'm just very happy that i get to sound smart now when i actually know a little bit about the start of the game just give it to the next episode and I'm going to be... Which, if you guys want in next episode, let me know by liking and commenting the video, right? Yeah, I'm not going to sound so smart when there's new stuff coming around. Even the small things over here is just throwing me off. Let's fill this water up. Let's get another purifier and then we're going to get a couple of bottles. I really need to get that plastic though so I can make some small boxes. The inventory is far from full, though, so let's get a couple just to empty out the water, and then we can be on our way. Oh, well, we need to get the engine as well, don't we? Oh, slap! Dirty water, clean water, very nice. Uh, wait, what am I thinking about? Can we eat the melon? Rotten food? No. That's gonna screw me over, isn't it? <laughs> good for me but i had to i can't help but putting things in my mouth <laughs> so slurp 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 and there we go all the water collected let's get that engine going shall we the food situation oh we could actually lower this down right we have the lure in the sloot let me show you what you can eat. Let's lower this. You need to be close to the smoke here as well. So you do a little bit of fishing. And now we just wait a little bit until that starts moving. And we know that we have something on. Oh, here we go. Race it. Wait, what's that? Lettuce? Consume dust lettuce. Wait, what? Take it. Can we read about this then? Lettuce-like vegetable with, uh, with speared leaves. Wait, can we just eat that straight off, you think? Last time, it was actually a moth that I got. And I think that's the only thing you could actually get by that. That time. Raw food is harmful to health. Cook food in clean water in electrical cooker. I don't have one. It's stressing me out tank engine let's slap this bad boy up Maximum there you go some more fuel we already had a little bit that we oh turn off turn off Printing completed. open fuel tank slap that in i can i think we can slap this in as well right 25 no oh wait we did already have that okay sweet oh that was metals never mind then I want to believe the uh, inventory feels way more solid. Oxygen tank? No way! <laughs> Sorry, that's that's actually also new. And I think it's time for us to turn this baby on. Okay, I want you to listen. I'm going to be quiet now. Believe it or not, I can be quiet. But now when we take off and just start floating away, just listen. that music dude can we get up a little bit control go down shift up heading forward oh wait speed can i do that yeah yeah i should be able to lock the speed here shit i'm not quiet am i <laughs> listen to the music it makes <laughs> lock it and i can leave it and it just goes and we can go out here uh, all of these lamps right here are driven by that battery. That's what I think, at least. So we want to go to these different stations to basically loot. Loot up and build our ship. 
out and make it bigger. You can make it more levels than one as well, I have you know. And if it gets heavier, I want to believe you can get two of these balloons or zeppelins, I think you call it. Oh, wait, wait, let's do this. Oh, I can't grab it. I think I can scan that. Let's float a little bit closer. Super excited. This is going to actually be co-op. Nice! Risk of airship damage. Wait, airship... J? What's going on here? J? Airship damage. The whole is Okay. So, for collisions with solid objects or fast landing... Oh, that's a dangerous one. The severity of damage depends on your speed. Float in the breeze. Collision with objects floating in the wind. They pose a danger at low at low at altitudes. So you actually want to get a little bit higher then. Lighting. Oh, danger of uh, high altitudes can be avoided by lowering altitudes or taking cover near high, uh, high objects. Dude, there's a danger to each and... Oh, there you go. Each and every level of this, dude. Here we go. That's the moths that I was talking about. So pretty much you can fish those guys up as well and you can cook them. Oh, we need to make a bed as well, don't we? Uh, let's get over to that place. And we're going to look into all of that. Unknown location. Approaching. Oh, that's another pod, ain't it? It is. I Ooh, okay. It's pretty lucky to crash land on these parts, though, aren't they? Okay, let's do this slow. Dude, no damage to the ship. Radio tower variant. So you have a bunch of them. Communication point. So that's something that we need. Plastic scrap. Electric elements. Communication facility. Ruins. That's completed. That's where we started, right? And this is a radio tower variant. And these holds plastic scrap, electric elements, and... Wrecked basic turbine. That's actually what we need to uh, gain altitude, right? Dude, this music is so on point. Solid state battery. Water. Um, scan this one. There you go. Yeah, this is what we need. Find a location with double flashlights. Oh, flashing lights, sorry. 50 hydration. We need to drink a little bit. Perfect. So, uh, we actually... We need that electrical cooker. I'm not really sure what to do about it, to be honest. Uh, were we able to make it? Wind turbine? Airship builder. We need this one. Uh, we need that one. And transformer, I guess. We need that craftable element used to produce advanced devices. You know what? I'm gonna put that down. And I think that might help us a little bit with uh, what we need. We need a bed as well. There's so much more now since I lost... Uh, was here, you know? Visited this planet. Or Earth. I don't know if we can call it home. It was 400 years ago, right? So... We didn't grew, grew up or grow up. It would be so cool if we could clean this place from this dust. It would take a lot, though, I can imagine. That is copper. It's got to be copper, right? Uh, elements. We might be able to salvage that with our ship, no? What do you think? Maybe. Ooh, repair parts. Some fuel. Okay, this is actually turning out pretty well. And then data card. Yoink, 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 yoink! Join Project Oxygen. Dude, I need to do that. My asthma is not good at the moment, so... I need all the oxygen I can get. <laughs> yoink, and there we go. Oh, and we can get up here as well. Perfect. Anything? Looks like fuel, doesn't it? You know when you go to the dentist... You watch from the chair and they have a picture up in the ceiling. This is what I'm going for here. So if we do that, I need to get some stuff. So it seems when it's raining, we don't get as much dirt. No, oh, no, no, it's flying about. It's flying about. Get all the synthetics. Here we go. Get the bed. I, I, my goal for today is to get over the clouds at least. 
I really do hope that I'm going to be able to do that. I think we're going to be able to do that. Ooh, look at that. That's the two lash. <laughs> I don't know what I tried to say. The two flashing lights. There you go. The lash. What the heck? And if we put that right there. You know what I mean? Just like we would be at the dentist's office. How about that? Blah, blah, blah. And there we go. Look at it, milking. <laughs> Why do I say stuff like this? Uh, yeah. Synthetics. That's the only thing that we need. I'm not getting any food. I think... Don't quote me on this one. But I think we will be able to grow shit in the future. Which is amazing. Get the builder. And now we should be able to build. But you know what? Uh, I kind of <laughs> need to find food somehow. Somewhere. Uh, we're gonna go up a little bit. And I think I want to go towards... We need to go towards those light. Is this what's gonna save me? Yes, the lettuce. Consume it! Mm, more food. Oh, oh. oh, I actually destroyed that. As long as it hits the balloon, it seems okay, though. We have another double light right there. What am I gonna do here? All right. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. I don't want to impress you, so, so you're scared to actually get into this game. It's like, oh, Fisk, you make it look so easy. You are really the best. You know? So I, I'm going to tell you <laughs> what I'm doing right here. So we're docked. I'm putting myself on the edge right here. So I can fish while I'm walking about. You know? Yeah. That's how smart, <laughs> smart I am. <laughs> Build a room on the airship. We're gonna do that. But uh, actually, what do we need? We need a room. Just th synthetics. Let's do that then. Back here. Give me the space lettuce! Ew! You know what? I'm gonna eat it live. Oh, let's get some sleep. <laughs> you might wanna check that breathing, dude. That's pretty much how I breed. <laughs> breed. Breathe. Oh, dude, yes, I can't wait to get over. Wait until you see us going over the clouds, dude. Seriously. It's so beautiful, this. Oh, my I lord, I can't wait to show you. Uh, can I do that? Blocked by Unvoyer Moont. Shit! Critically damaged! Bullshit! Where? Okay, let me put my smooch all over that. Where is it? Ooh, it's actually hurting. Look at that. Oh, that's cool. So when that's happening, you kind of put, like, chewed gum on it. Or space goo or something. Actually, I should look uh, look out where I'm, uh, where I'm walking right here. <laughs> it's going to end with me falling down. There you go. Did you see that? I could go down. How cool is that? Build a new wall. What? You know what? We're going to pick this up. And we're going to put that back here. Just move it back a little bit. Plastic wall. One more. No. Blap. There you go. Let's explore this little place. We need more water, though. I have the water. So don't listen to me. We, de we do need more food. I need to figure that situation out pretty... You know what? I don't. We just need more of these. Slap some lure downs and do some fishing. I just need some space lettuce. lettuce. I, I'm just making it way harder than it has to be, you know? But this is what happens when I uh, I get stressed out and confused. Let's just yoink, yoink all of this. I was about to say, dude, this... Wait, ooh. Take lead soup balloon? I was about to read that as Led Zeppelin. But we're gonna have that up in the ceiling as well. Just like babies have those over their cribs. I'm pretty sure I just called myself a giant baby. Ooh, plastic! Let's just repark this so we can do some fishing. Shit! Let's get the cooker. Oh, 
I like that. Do you see that? Before you place them just like this one. I love it. If they could do that on this one as well. I mean, you should be able to put that further in as well. This one, you need to put it on the edge. That clamp, you see it right there. That is so cool. I really like that touch. Oh, oh can I please? Yes. Here we go. And then we're going to cook the moth. Boil it. Boil it alive! Please, por favor, sir, I need some mutu. Dude, I'm on the edge of the starving right here. Printing completed. Thank you very much. What's it on? Printing completed. I was just about to say, how's the boiling coming along? Uh, 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 uh consume it. So that, oh, that's half, dude. That's way better. Oh, Chef Fisky Poo. If I could, I would invite each and every one of you to my spaceship to uh, to eat space lettuce and moths together. Dude, this is great. I love that. I need this soundtrack on Spotify. It's so relaxing. Thank you. I love it. <laughs> like how it just ends when I swim away. <laughs> Dude, that is so funny. Consume it right from uh, that place. Dude, I'm still waiting for this just to drag up this humongous monster that just bites my head off. Can you imagine? Wait, that's a different one. Fat dust moth. That's not nice calling it fat. <laughs> so that gives you 10 more in food. Let's cook it and see. So 25 in food, minus 5 water, 10 health minus. All right, let's boil it. I don't know how I strang that sentence together, but I did. Yeah, we really need to get above the, cloud, the clouds today. I really want to show you guys that. Oh, this is a big one. This is a big one. We got two rooms right here. Some of these do have some sort of jumping puzzle, so you don't really want to fall down and die. Oh my God, that scared me. Stop. Uh, just to be as efficient as possible. Perfect. And let's take that up. Check the fat one. Sixty food, dude! Diseases might become more severe. Wow. That is good. That is something that I can get behind. Ooh, wait, a new battery? There you go. Did I pick that up before? Research that. There's so much going on, but I'm enjoying every second of it. It's just amazing. I want to see how long I can let these guys sit here. If I can just leave them there until I need them. Uh, now I should be able to make plastic as well. Yes. We're going to make some fuel here. I didn't check for the plastic, did I? Let's get it right here. Uh, we need to... We need the plastic to get the boxes right. I wish... Uh, it would be nice to have some sort of shelf uh, where we could uh, put them. Uh, yeah, let's go up first. Just stack multiple small shelves. I'm sure we're gonna get the oh, shelves, uh, boxes. I'm pretty sure we're gonna get bigger ones as well as we go. Data card. Metal flooring. There you go. Get the battery. That's a good indication as well. Oh. That's a good indication as well that you've been to these. That you pick up all the uh, the batteries. We are experiencing this on the highest uh, possible settings right now. And it's so smooth. It's so... It's just so nice on the eye. In my face. In my eyes. It's great. Diseases might become more severe. Don't tell me about my diseases. Small box. Making it. We just needed the plastic, I think. I didn't check. 
I just saw that I could do it. All right, let's... Uh, yeah. Satellite. Oh, there you go. Small storage. Perfect. Aim for the trash. Tires, dude. That is so weird to see that in this place, though, isn't it? Okay, we need our ship to open this up, right? Is it... It might work. It might work. Um, but seeing that in a place like this, like something from the old, old world, you know? <laughs> I need to stop with sounds, man. <laughs> I, I, I have a problem. <laughs> you know what? I think it's, it might just be the walls. I think I can actually get in. There you go. Wait, no, wait, oh, wait. Can I get... Oh, wait. I think we got the entrance from the high... Oh, well, through, to be honest. That's perfect. Uh, we haven't found copper yet. I would think that would be the copper. It looks like big... Copper lines, doesn't it? Right, I think that's it. Let's boil this while we're waiting. Oh, well, we're doing other things, I guess. Let's go for the double lights then, eh? Keep an eye out for synthetics. Wait, this... We should get another extractor as well, to be honest. On the other side. That's perfect. How many do we need? We need uh, four more. So let's just go... Oh, wow. Did you see that? Flashing? That looked like something big, didn't it? Let's uh, get some boxes here. Can I get two? One at a time? All right. Do we need any fuel? We have 12 now. There you go. We're fine. Let's go for the double lights. I wonder if I can actually stack these. I don't remember, but... Let's put the, the batteries in here. And that... Uh, I think we could just uh, keep all of this on. Leave the glass. But all of this is something that we will use. Wait, what's going on? Are we getting hurt? Oh, that's it. We're getting hit. There's a lot of things going on here. We really need to get uh, to higher latitudes. Listen to me. Make a turbine using big words. <laughs> Ooh. Look at that. That all changed, didn't it? It was green before. That is blue. Are we getting closer? What is this? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's slow down a little bit. That is something new. I never seen this before. All right, we need to get up there. We got. Oh, you know what? I think I can't sleep here, right? All right, let's get that turbine. Ooh, you know what? Let's hold on to that. Um, what do we need? Okay, okay, calm down now. We need. I need sleep. Let's go there. Land, sleep. Put the turbine on. Oh, it says right there, research the turbine and build... Yeah, 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 yeah. We need the turbine to actually get up there. We, we are on the highest altitude right now. Altitude, that's how you say it, right? Uh, let's slap this that's one right there, then. That is such a bad place for shooting, right? But for now... Uh, I'm just gonna put it right there. It's still in the way. I want to put it somewhere else. But right now, we're going to keep it right there. Uh, let's see. Go up. Is this going to be over the clouds? It is. Oh, wow. Wait, this is... I haven't seen it like this before. Look at the sun. Look at the color. This is so pretty. Dude, sense the demo. Just the movement itself. As, uh, like, the... Oh, my lord. This is so cool. Let's land this big boy. I am so excited. It looks like a bunker up in the skies, doesn't it? Let's land this. All good. No damage. The preliminary analysis started. Standard wind farm. Let's see what this is then. Uh, variance what wind farm. So right here we can get wrecked location radar. Standard wind farm. Uh, helium. I don't know what we would need that for. 
uh, copper and circuit boards. Research two shooms. We already completed all of this. All right, sweet. So also, I need to remember to scan shit. If you guys see me forgetting to scan something, be like, Oi! You idiot. So now we actually got the copper. We need it. This is so huge. We need to move it. I don't know where to go, dude. Uh, we have something up here we can scan. Okay, we need to sleep as well. I forgot about that. So let's... I'm going to scan this one. We got helium right here as well, I take it. Helium, yeah, perfect. Helium fuel balloon core. Expand balloon. Oh, so we need helium for the balloon. Goddamn big brain fisk. Actually didn't hit me. Is it it's we we're actually on a zeppelin. We need helium, right? Nutrition level is decreasing. Here we go early in the morning. Oh my we can see the sun. Look at this. Okay. <laughs> get! Get gone! Let's try to eat me! Help me! <laughs> Let's get some food. Eat that. We need to get something to drink. There you go. Wow, this is so beautiful. Alright, let's do what I was supposed to do. Climb down. And put this away. Removal mode. Oh, that's good to know. An old wind turbine. Can I salvage this then? Or have I just researched it? I can't uh, tear this down, can I? Oh, maybe with the, the ship, right? Let's see if we can do that. Uh, we're just going to loot everything we can by hand. And then we're going to take flight and see if we can go in and just beam it. Oh, careful now. I didn't even think about that twice. I'm really scared of heights as well. Um, can drop down right. Oh. Down. Come on. Oh. There you go. Feels like I took the stupid way down. Got a drink, some circuit boards. Hey, that's a graphics card though, isn't it? Sweet. We needed that. We unlocked some stuff and there we go. Glass floor. Dude, we can actually have a glass floor. So we can look down. The ships that you're going to be able to make, man. Wow. Uh... No way, I need to jump that. Do I? Can I please get around this way? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. This is actually making my legs itch right here. Yeah, it's old computer cases I didn't notice. I should have when it was a graphics card in them. Yeah, we must be able to uh, just collect these ones with the, with the extractor, right? It's going to be a little bit more trick on the one down there because that had a shell around it. Uh, 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 let's get here. Get the battery. Get some helium. Let's get up. And also, I can't wait to go in down into the smoke either. That is going to be badass. But that I think that's going to be something for another episode. Once again, if you guys want it, uh, let's pick this up. Can I even put... I wish I could put that on there. But can I? Ooh. There you go. Then it's not going to be in the way, right? Just for us flying. But that's that's just fine, I would say. Uh, we're going to research. Ooh, look. Motherboard extractor. So extra extracts raw resources from object remains. So this is like the one we have on the ship, but we're going to be able to have that on our arm. Location radar. This is what we need to make. Advanced insects lore. New rain collector. Helium fuel. We can do that. And while we're doing that, let's see if I can get to the... The copper right here. I kind of want to get this down here. I think we need to fly around a little bit. I'm going to focus on that first. then I think we had one more in there as well that we could sh we should be able to see from there it would be so much easier to actually have the extractor but that's a crystal and I would assume 
that is from down below. Like under the underneath the dust. Here you go. Yeah, we should be able to see that. Let's turn this big boy around. Here you go. What should we call the ship, by the way? I, I, I think I should leave that to you guys. Give me a good name for a ship. Don't give me shitty ones. I don't want shitty ones. Just good, <laughs> good names. <laughs> can I get to that? Please. Can I? Yes. Yes. Oh. Ah! <laughs> I'm so annoyed. I'm so sorry. <laughs> see if I can land this right here. Uh, we're going to see if I can grab one of these. And that actually works. All right, sweet. We're going to put one of those in here. We're going to boil it. We're going to put the other one in there as well. Actually, with the cooking, I wonder if we're going to be able to... Uh, the music. Uh, if we're going to be able to dry, dry them as well, right? That would be dope. This is just an old ship, ain't it? Yeah, dude, this this was huge, wasn't it? So this is uh, Remnants? No, not Remnants. What do you call it? It's uh, well, debris from another world, I guess. Yeah, we can't do anything with that. Is that blood? No, it's just paint, is it? I don't know. Hmm, interesting. What? Immunity is decreasing. Diseases might become more severe. Let's see. Then we have all of that. We need to make glass. Make glass? No, we need to find glass. I don't think we can make it, right? Do we have anything around here? We might have something. Mm, I don't know. I think we need to fly to one of these ones, right? To get the glass that we need for the, uh, the ruder. Then I'm actually happy because we we've been over the clouds now or over the over the dust. And uh, I think we should get ourselves a radar as well. Ooh, watch out now. Whew. It's a close call. Communication point fuel depleted. Ege. Printing completed. There we go. Got two of them. So that should be full. A bada bing, bada boom. I'm gonna put the battery in here as well. The moth is ready to be eaten. Thank you very much. You know what? Yeah, exactly. It needs to be lowered down further. But for now, we're actually fine. I'm just gonna land and check this place out. Ooh, that's the glass that we need. Let's turn, her, turn around. Metal. Boy, was I wrong. What about that one? That's glass. All right. So now we should have the glass that we need to make. First off, I don't want to check this out. There you go. Get the water catcher when it's raining. I don't know if the rain is... The rain should be dirty, right? Uh, the rest of the glass is in here. No, we need five, didn't we? We did. We must be able to find one more glass here, right? Are we good? That was actually pretty good landing, wasn't it? We get a circuit board. I'm just going to do everything that I can right there. Can I put the f like helium in here then? Okay, so that's more efficient. Medium efficiency, exactly. So low efficiency. So let's leave that right now. Perfect. Then, then we know. Then we know. I could have read that earlier. I know, but I didn't. Uh, circuit boards. That is perfect. We could make that right off the bat. Put that one right there. Do I need to put anything underneath, you think? No. We're actually doing really good. I'm I'm very proud of we what we have achieved today. Uh, more glass. That's what we need. Oh, uh, do I need to go down? I think that's what we need to do. Glass, yes! This shall be everything that we need to make that ruder. 
Wait, where did I put it? Oh, I'm an idiot. That's why. Here you go. Let's back it up. Do I want to back it up? No. Bring her down. <laughs> Dude. Damn it! Bloop. That's a nice little touch, though. I like that. We haven't yet... We haven't yet to see... Is that how you say it? The... Uh, the bad weather, right? Ruder. Oh, do I want to put this where I'm driving, right? Yeah, exactly. Dude. Am I smart? Or am I dumb for doing this? No, I think I'm pretty smart, right? So we have points of interest. Five of them. Navigation technology. Perfect. Done. That is... Uh, everything is pretty much like two to three kilometers away. That is very cool. Let's get the motherboard. Let's search this place. Get all of the loot that we can. Thank you, lady in my helmet. Helmet lady. That's a good name for her, right? Ooh. Insect lure. I was about to scream right there. I wasn't sure if I was able to get out. Imagine. Lock myself in. More glass. We need to get that. Glass is uh, pretty hard to come by, it seems. Yoink. Short railing. Yeah, that's actually something I need. So if this is going to become a series, I'm going to spend one of these episodes in the future to just make a really dope ship. Just building. Going around looting and build. To see what we can uh, make and then expand on it. Give me uh, the battery. Now I'm happy. Caution. A storm is coming. Ooh. Dude. No, no. I might have bit off more than I can chew right here. I, w I think I jinxed the shit out of that. Oh, it's ramping up, dude. Okay, we should be fine because we're close to this. And this is higher than what our... Oh, my lord. Than our... Uh... Our balloon. Oh my god. Please don't hit me. Please, por favor, monster. I love thunder. It's so amazing to see, but it also scares me, man. It's. It's so cool. We should be cool. We should. We should be good. Oh my god, it actually did it! So if we're higher up, that is what's gonna happen to our balloon. And if that's filled with helium, we're gonna have a really bad time. That is so cool. Oh, we gotta experience that. I'm so happy, dude. Alright, I'm gonna take shelter in here for now then. I can't close this. I mean, oh wait, we can make doors, right? Can't we? But yeah, I think we could spend the time here for now. I would love to hear from you and see if you guys are going to play the game yourself. And once again, a huge shout out to Far From Home and Forever Skies for sponsoring the first episode of this potential series. I, uh, I can't thank you enough. I'm so happy to have been along for the ride since the demo. And I'm just looking forward to the future. My name is Fisk. Thank you for watching.